been doing this all day. It's cold, it's warm. Yeah. I'm at 20. Yeah, so just 10 more seconds. Yeah, and then just walk to the Range Rover. Just watch out for the lilac tree. There you go. <laughs> you're good. <Kate>. <laughs> you're good. <laughs> See, that's nice right there. That's the goal we're going for. Yeah. I've always thought we were I know. And then wait for 30 seconds. And the other thing I do is when they're wandering around like this, I notice if there's anything that weirds them out or makes them bark, because okay. I might set them up for that later. You don't have to worry about it, you know. Okay. We will pick it up. Good job. And then stop. Wait for 30 seconds. There wasn't on there. No bag on the lead. Oh, I used okay. it. Probably when I took the dogs for a walk oh, okay. yesterday. We can get one up there. One more. I figure everyone will do like two. Oh, okay, perfect. Then we'll have it. There might be a nail stuck on the There you go. Okay. So it's a very simple first week, but they get harder after this. Okay. <laughs> Y'all think it'll be easy all the time. Nope. This is what we call the foundation of the training, though. Okay. Hi, sweetie. Hi. I'm fine. I'm just holding Hi, it. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm Robert. I'm nice Jeff. To nice you. to meet you. Hi. Do you want me to help you with that thing? I like it like this so I can focus on their walking instead of just leaving the camera there. You bet. <laughs> yeah. yeah, always look down before you move. Just make sure the leash isn't wrapped around your feet. <laughs> he wants to follow Robert. Yeah. <laughs> Hello! Aren't you nice? Yeah, I wish dog training was just this easy. <laughs> well, hopefully he'll be a little bit more difficult for us. He's well, being pretty good right now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't I get too say, complacent. I can sit in the chair and train all day long. Yes, exactly. <laughs> we all wish we could. Right. Well, he's not too timid. He's got a healthy curiosity about him. Oh, because we've had a flood of uh, fearful ones lately. I wouldn't call him fearful, like on the, you know, high alert, but he's yeah. inquisitive and, um... All right, now we can switch. Good job, Pete. Oh. And we've had uh, five puppies to train at once, so. Oh my goodness, that's a lot. It is. <laughs> it's easier to have five older dogs to train. Than five puppies. In some, yeah, pup, the good thing about puppies is you don't really have to worry that much about dog fights or, yeah. you know. I don't know how you corral five dogs. <laughs> you don't do it at once, though. No, 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 no. <laughs>
<laughs> I take them all each individually. And by week three, they've all learned not to interrupt each other's training, training sessions. So when we're doing this in our backyard, the other dogs are inside. Yeah. That would be helpful for Willie. Eventually, they can be, get, be out, you know? And for a little puppy, like our pug, you would just you shorten your distance. No. You would? No, but my, my five foot rule on the next step yeah. isn't a five foot rule with puppies. Okay. I just want them paying attention to where I am. Okay. So I run if they're, I, I would let them maybe get 10 feet away from me before I'd run. Okay. It's basically if I see them clearly, uh, do you need a jacket? We have extra ones. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm wearing my ski jacket right now. <laughs> With that thin thinsulate in it. Alright, watch out for the lilac. There we go. Good job. <laughs> just missed it. <laughs> I just don't want the leash to get wrapped around yeah. it and <laughs> take his little head off. It's been like a puppy explosion for the pandemic. Yeah. You know, <laughs> like everyone has a puppy right now. Well, we were just talking about that earlier. Yeah. <laughs> we adopted, we had planned uh, in like January to adopt in March. That's nice. Our youngest. And it was really good timing. Um, so we've had <laughs> friends that adopted kind of at the last moment because of the pandemic and they're all cold. <laughs> <laughs> Right, yeah. She used to be worried when we all go back to school. Or I'm a little bit worried about, yeah, our baby because she's not used to being home alone at all. Well, but she is. She's good in the She yeah. likes her kind of like that. Yeah. She just sleeps. Yeah. And she has like 18 toys in there. <laughs> she brings all of her toys with her. So she she runs volleyball in ones and like a whole like she like eight balls in there. She pours. She pours. Yeah. 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 <laughs> We have one that naturally does that too, and Robert thought I had set up the picture for that. Just go over. There you go. Oh. <laughs> We've never used a kettle before, but we are with her, and she, um, like at dinner time, we put her in there. Yeah. And, uh, it's been good for her. It is. It will help them uh, be able to adjust to people not being home later, yeah. too. I, as in my dog, recently had an operation to remove some mammary glands, and I'm glad that, you know, we've always had okay. our dogs kennel trained. Well, we don't, they don't always go in it, but they're kind of, you know, like when I'm training another dog, I'll yeah. usually kennel them so that they can watch and know how to calm down. <coughs> so she's a lot more calmer at the vets than she would be. Yeah, if they're not. Make sure right. you He's being responsive to when you're getting ready to go. He's probably like, I'm going to walk somewhere else. I know this flock, so I've peed on it. Silly question, but does it need to be a triangle per se? Or could you like do it on your street and or is there too much You can if you can make three points on your street and there's no cars. Okay, yeah. Like I can get away with it a lot of times on my street. Yeah. But there are times where my, my street was busy the other day with cars. Yeah, probably not very Wait, is there a hammock in the front yard? You saw how to do this? You got it? I think so. <laughs> I have to look sometimes. You're walking in. Yeah. The hardest part is the 35. <laughs> Don't lose count. <laughs> Oh, 
out of his own life. You can walk any time. <laughs> Go. Very nice. <laughs> All the chipmunks are coming out to say hi. Chipmunks are squirrels. Well, I hear, yeah, I hear the chipmunks. That, those little high pitched. The, um, we have trees in our backyard. The squirrels can make it from one tree to the next and out the yard. And yeah. the dogs just lose their minds trying to catch them. We have everything around here, groundhogs, turkeys, foxes, oh, yeah, yeah. coyotes, yeah, the coyotes I don't love. deer. I like how happy he looks just walking. Yeah. I mean, he is a pretty... Pretty easy to please. Yeah. That's why when I see him being, you know, taking off and, um, or being aggressive, you know, I, I just hate to... I think you said it. You don't want to fail your dog. No. Well, the other thing about small dogs,